I rode with IKEA is to head up FM globally, um, and um, that means um, defining the uh, what FM should be for IKEA uh, at a global level. You know, what we try to do is we try to because we have a lot a lot of good practices going on um, in, in FM in each of the countries. What we try to do now is to start finding best practice and, and start benchmarking and defining what good FM for IKEA should be. I think as, as well, throughout my career in FM, I, I've seen that the issues um, that you face are um, communicating what FM is about and what it is good for and, and um, also uh, perhaps to define uh, the scope for FM because it's so easy that you are seen as someone who should do everything mm -hmm. and, and then of course you have to meet those expectations and those, that can be difficult. We have a lot of standards in IKEA in the, in the early phases, in the, in the planning phases, construction phases etc. And of course you all see in the, the blue boxes, they look yes. pretty similar. Uh, but but uh, we also need to be able to uh, perhaps not because we're doing badly, but we have really to be very responsive to the changes in IKEA, mm -hmm. so that that we show an organisation that is that is ready for what IKEA is going to do. Mm -hmm. So we we perhaps want to step up a bit and be even more in the forefront um, with the with the changes in IKEA. So I think the goal, the ultimate goal, will be to create the the IKEA way of doing FM. Um, the financial situation today definitely affects the countries differently because uh, some countries um, see, really see FM as the, the, the solution yes. uh, to get out of a recession perhaps or to save, uh, to, to, to make the, these cost cuttings that they need to make or to uh, perhaps get that extra improvement in quality. So I think that where FM is perhaps a, a less developed market, um, what, as far as I've seen, it's not that affected right. uh, because um, a lot, a lot of uh, in, a lot of organisations, a lot of industries, perhaps turn to FM to, as a solution when when things go bad. And I, I, I do think that is is true for 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 many many countries. Also in the UK, I think would be would be true. Mm -hmm. um, but I mean, a global recession. Um, the, the other thing that that we need to to be aware of is that the recession hits at very different points in time mm -hmm. uh, in different markets. I mean, UK was very early mm -hmm. and, and perhaps the recession has not even reached um, the profession in some countries yet. Mm -hmm.